Okay, so what I got going is, is I'm kind of building a control panel style system. So I'm going to install these steppers. Okay, so they're micro USB on one end and then whatever I want to attach to the other. And I have three of them. And they're all going to be at different volts. So it'd be like 12, a 5, and then maybe like a 3 or another 12 or whatever I need. I could control the the voltage in them and then I'm gonna have them all wired and then running up until I have like a, um, a USB here and then with my USB I have a USB voltmeter so as you can see I'm just starting to kind of get the wiring rigged up so I'm just gonna I'm gonna keep going and then I'm gonna show you guys where I'm gonna install it at so we'll go from there but progress is being made as for now I'm sure got your uh, blue and black so positive and negative and then you got your wire snipper so we're just going to take the wire snippers and just stick the wire in about you know about a quarter of the way in and go like that and it will clean the wire nice and that's it so it cleans the wire good and then what you want to do is give them a little twist like that and then maybe another little twist like that alright I've already made this mistake once so what we're going to do is we're going to take the board and the wiring and we're going to see I got these little channels set up right here can you see the holes I got these channels set up for these well I guess I'll have to do one at a time so anyway you just thread the wire through thread the wire through okay like that and then this and then what we'll do is we'll just wrap this wire up and we'll keep it all to the side until we need power or anything to power this because right now I don't have anything to hook this to. I don't have a need for it. So we're just going to connect this and then wrap it around and then make it look good. So I'll I'll go ahead and do that. So I'll set that down. And then I'll, uh, I'll bring the camera. got it to run through we are working on a on an ESD mat and I have an ESD ankle bracelet on to try to keep some of the clutter down off the desk and off my hands so there we go and then we're going to hit it with the glue gun yeah you can solder it but if I ever wanted to remove the wiring all I got to do is take like a blow dryer or something and heat that glue up and then I can pull the wire right off of it so anyway now we got our secondary so now we got our secondary switch or wiring ran. So we're just going to go ahead and pull that out clean like that so it looks clean. Okay, so what we'll do with this just ball it up. Stay. Like that. 
so we'll just ball it up and leave it and then I'll wire the other one through the hoop and then into the USB power and then once I have it all hooked together and what it will look like all right that's right I'm handy camming this bitch no microphones no nothing okay so what I did is I took it and I put these little feed on it on here and here and then as you can see I got this track that I built in the room see on my room right here so as you walk in you see the track so anyway I built it to where these little things will sit down yeah okay so right in there and then on the back side see the little leg that I built it's like a little kickstand uh, except for it sh should go like behind this thing but I don't know why it's not okay so like that so it'll sit like that can y'all see that it'll sit just like that and then if I want and then I'm gonna run power actually let me rephrase that I'm gonna run power to it and then my sequels and then everything else I need so that way and then like it'll power like this thing there will be a light in here so this will power that and then I have some other stuff going on back there so this one will power this one and then that one will power this right here so like I have a fan sitting here see the fan I got a fan there and then I'm uh, kind of connected together and put it on there but yeah that's that's my idea of making a little cheap control panel um, to allow me to work with low voltage uh, these little steppers will go up to 24 volts but I, I don't need 24 volts so but anyway guys I just wanted to show you all that real quick I'm gonna I'm gonna keep on going until I have a complete and finished project and I'll show it to y'all at the end okay so I went ahead and got it hooked up like I said I was I um, only got two out of the three hooked up right now and right now we're at zero amp um, we should be at five volts so if I was to plug this in it should it should jump to at least four amps or so I'm not sure we're gonna find out so there it goes wait a minute hold on here right now so yeah okay so it is reading alright so I got the voltmeter out alright guys I'm gonna show y'all something real simple on the voltmeter right here it says D DCV okay put it on 20 that means that it's from 0 to 20 volts just to make it simple for y'all alright so it's on 0 and we got our leads here wow this is hard to do one handed let me tell y'all something this is real damn hard to do one handed okay so I'm going to just check to see if we have any power coming out of these so let's okay so it's working it I saw it it came up on the screen as uh, it jumped around from 5 to 7 volts so that's good so my little control center is working uh, now I gotta do is just put it in its place and hook the other two up and go from there guys so yeah this is my little uh, circuit board idea that I built of a control module pretty uh, simple to build what do y'all think yeah you guys like it cool give me a thumbs up if y'all like it appreciate it alright so I put it up and there it is that's how it's gonna sit just like that um, I did notice that it was missing something so that gave me the idea
I will show you what the point is of using the JB weld but you want to get it nice and mixed up like that smooth it around until you get kind of like a grayish color god that stuff stinks All right. okay, so here's our model alright so I'm going to set the camera down Okay, so now since I got that done, I JB welded these brackets to this aluminum. And then what I'm going to do is up there on that is I went ahead and I put together this light, this um, LED light module. And what it's going to do is the light's going to sit like that on the tower and it's going to sit like this so that aluminum will sit here and then the light will shine like that can you see the light will shine on that so when I flip the switch the light will come on and it will shine on that and I'll have this wired into one of these to share power through it so yeah that's my idea what do you think I'm going to add like a light tower to it and see what that looks like when it's all said and done. But this is going to take a few hours, guys, and I don't want to wait around all that time and wait for this to dry. So we're just going to go from there. Movie magic. All right, I did it. What do you all think? Look, I installed a light. See how it shines right on it so that way if I need to get up at night I don't feel like turning on that light I can just flip a switch and then I see everything that way I can adjust it so yeah that's my that's my light that I just rigged up what do y'all think pretty cool huh I think it's pretty cool so yeah that's it, man. Give me a thumbs up. Peace.